Hey guys, welcome to another Cooking with Shan. Today I'm going to be making a shrimp salad. Um, I got this salad recipe from my mom and my dad when they were together many, 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 many years ago. Um, every Sunday for Sunday dinner, we'd always have like this, this shredded salad with um, vinegar and sugar and it would be so addicting. Like I would just eat the shredded vegetables like by itself with a spoon like it's so good my um dad is not really a fan of cucumbers but i'm obsessed so i added cucumbers and then i added shrimp to it because my husband likes a full meal so i so i made it like an appetizer type of vibes so it's really good so first you're gonna start with two carrots you're gonna shred them up like so then you're gonna get your cucumber i like to leave some skin on my com my cucumber I feel like it gives it like an extra crunch. Plus, I love cucumbers. Number one, you need to get the extra long cucumber. The one that comes in, like they're individually sold and they come wrapped in like really tight plastic. You're going to get one of those. That's, that's all you need and it's enough. Then you're going to shred your cucumber about halfway. You don't need to shred the whole thing. You only want half of that cucumber shredded. The other half, or I, I mean, I guess it's like, three-fourths of the way that look that one-third you're just gonna slice them up into tiny slices and then put them to the side then you're going to get your cabbage um I made it one time and I found a half a cabbage but ever since that one time I found that half a cabbage I cannot find cabbage sold separately so I have yet to find cabbage like cut in half so you just buy a whole cabbage you can save the other half for another time you want to make salad or or not and so you just shred your half a cabbage, that's all you need. Then you're going to get, put everything in your bowl and then combine it with your hands. I use a really small bowl so everything got really messy. Green butterhead lettuce. Let me tell you guys. I am obsessed with this lettuce. It's like live lettuce. It still has the roots and everything on it so you need to wash it thoroughly. But I'm obsessed. It tastes amazing. Like this is like a really good lettuce. You can use whatever lettuce. Like my parents used to use... Um, the, the regular lettuce, like the basic the basic stuff, like really, really basic. But, I mean, you can use that too. There's nothing wrong with that. Then you're going to get your vinegar and your sugar, and you're going to mix it together in a bowl. And then you're just going to pour it over your shredded, your shredded vegetable mixture, and then you're going to stir it in. The sugar gives it, like, a sweet taste, but the vinegar gives it, like, a tangy taste, like... You're going to take it. I'm like, you're going to be like, oh my God, let me not. I used a cast iron because I just wanted to make it look cute. You can use like a regular bowl or like if you have like a, um, like a container, you can do it too. Or like these would make really good um, salad wraps. Like you just take the lettuce and then you just wrap the shredded vegetables in it and then you can, you can make that too. It's so good. Then you just leave a little hole in the middle because that's where you want your shrimp to go. So that's how step one of your salad looks. Then you're going to add your cucumbers like so. Um, my dad doesn't like cucumbers, like I said, so he doesn't even use cucumbers, but I'm obsessed, so ex excessive everything. Now onto the garlic buttered shrimp. You're going to put your butter and your garlic in a pot on like medium heat and going to saute that for like a minute and a half. Then you're going to stir it occasionally because you don't want your garlic to burn. Then you're going to add your shrimp one by one just to make sure that everything like fits together. Like so. Then you're going to grab your seasoning. Here you're going to season it with onion powder, pepper, and chili powder. You don't need salt. Um, I feel like salt will make it a little too salty. But if you feel like you, you just love salt that much, you can add like just a, just a pinch, just a pinch. So you can add your seasoning and then you're going to cook your shrimp for about four to five minutes per side. Once it's cooked, you're going to flip over and then that's how your cooked shrimp should look. Then you just do a little quick little stir, quick little stir and make sure you know all the seasoning and the juices are on there. Good, good, good. Then you're going to take your from pot to your salad, you're going to add your shrimp right to the middle. This is like a 30 minute quick meal. It's so good. It's so quick and easy to make. Like, it's a really good appetizer or like a snack. Like, you know, it's a good summer snack. 
well i hope you guys enjoyed this twist on a basic family recipe like comment share subscribe tell me you guys what you think and tell me how addictive that shredded vegetables is with the vinegar and sugar i'm telling you, you will never stop eating it it's so good thanks for watching bye